You are watching KSG News Explainer. In this video, we are going to talk about Chandrayaan 2 detecting solar proton events. A large area soft X-ray spectrometer, that is class, a payload on board Chandrayaan 2 orbiter has detected solar proton events which significantly increase the radiation exposure to humans in space. The instrument on 18th of January 2022 also recorded coronal mass ejections, that is CMEs, leading to geomagnetic storms and lighting up the polar sky with auroras, the ISRO said. The facts to be remembered here are such multipoint observations help us understand the propagation and its impact on different planetary systems. When the sun is active, spectacular eruptions called solar flares occur that sometimes also spew out energetic particles called solar proton events or SPEs into interplanetary space. Most of these are high energy protons that impact space systems and significantly increase radiation exposure to humans in space. They can cause ionization in large scales in the Earth's middle atmosphere. Many intense solar flares are accompanied by CMEs, a powerful stream of ionized material and magnetic fields which reach the Earth a few days later, leading to geomagnetic storms and lighting up the polar sky with auroras. The glass instrument also detected a CME event as it passed through the moon due to an MI.5 class solar flare that occurred on 18th of January 2022. The CME travels at a speed of about 1,000 km per second and it takes about 2 to 3 days to reach the Earth. The signature of this event is missed by the GOES satellite as the Earth's magnetic field provides shielding from such events. However, the event was recorded by Chandrayaan-2. The class payload on Chandrayaan-2 saw both the SPE and CME events pass by from two intense flares on the Sun. Now, let us tell you about solar flares. Solar flares are classified according to their strength. The smallest ones are A-class, followed by B, C, M and X. Each letter represents a tenfold increase in energy output. This means that an M-class flare is 10 times more intense than C-class flare and 100 times intense than B-class flare. Within each letter class, there is a finer scale from 1 to 9. A M2 flare is twice the strength of M1 flare. Recently, there were two M-class solar flares. One flare, that is M5.5, spewed out energetic particles into interplanetary space, and the other flare, M1.5, was accompanied by a CME. The SPE event was seen by NASA's Geostationary Operational Environmental Satellite, that is GOES, orbiting around the Earth. However, the CME event was not detected by GOES. Chandrayaan-2 Large Area Soft X-ray Spectrometer on board Chandrayaan-2 Orbiter detected SPE due to an M5.5 class solar flare that occurred on the 20th of January 2022. Going into some background details, planned to land on the moon's south pole, Chandrayaan-2 was launched on 22nd of July 2019. However, the lander Vikram hard landed on 7th of September 2019, crashing India's dream to become the first nation to successfully land on the lunar surface in its maiden attempt. The ISRO had then said the mission achieved 98% success as the orbiter continues to share data with the ground station. That's it for this explainer. Thank you so much for watching. To join KSG India courses and to crack the IS exam, visit ksgindia.com. You can also get a PDF of this explainer on ksgindia.com. Thanks for watching and do subscribe to our channel.